Um, I don't have a funny intro idea, so just look at this cute thing. That's the cutest fucking thing I've ever seen in my entire life. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Gina. Welcome back to the channel. So it has been brought to my attention that little Eddie boy has attempted his very own mukbang. Big Ed Korean mukbang and dating secret. Oh, Eddie boy got dating secrets? <laughs> Fill me in. Now, I don't know about you guys, but watching a life-size testicle stuff his big old pie hole sounds pretty damn enticing to me. Sign me the fuck up. Before we get started, if you guys would like to support the channel and sign up for my Patreon, I would greatly appreciate it. Now let's puke in our mouths a little bit, shall we? Hey, Big Ed here. This is Big Ed. Can someone get homeboy a booster seat? I wonder if they sell booster seats for adults on Amazon. They have to. Oh, they sure do. Tonight, I decided to have me some um, Korean um, food, mukbang style. Okay, at least he pronounces mukbang properly. I'll give him that. I cannot tell you how many people mispronounce mukbang. People who have mukbang channels. Mukbang. 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 I don't know where to begin. I think I'm going to start with this right here. I don't know what it is, but it smells great. You don't know the name of the thing that you ordered? How, how did you order it? ASMR activated. Is that what you call bad table manners? Oh my god, it's... <coughs> It's spicy, but it's good. Oh my god, this is so good. Oh shit, I'm getting on my shirt. He just had to pull his shirt forward to check where the noodle fell because he only has so much range of motion in his neck. This is so good. Bye, have a great time. And down the hatch it goes. Oh my god. That is so good. Richard, that's so good. Who's Richard? Is somebody standing on the other side of the camera watching him do this? <laughs> Poor Richard. Richard, that's so good. So have you ever been to Korea? I've never been to Korea. I've been to North Korea. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I've never been to Korea. I love Korean women. They're so beautiful. I would love to, uh, I wanna go to Korea. I wanna go to Taiwan and Vietnam. Taiwanese, Vietnamese, and Korean fathers still living in their countries. Hi, your daughters. Big Ed is coming to town. Those are my three, those are my three favorite. Chew your food first. I don't want you to choke. Asian cities that I want to go to. Oh yeah, Vietnam, Taiwan, and Korea sound like great Asian cities. <laughs> but I love, um, I love um, Asian culture. I love it so much, but my geography of Asia is just a little rusty. And I love Asian women, you know why? Because they're probably about the same height as you, give or take a few inches. Because they age well, just like wine. Malbec wine, right? And they're sweet. Is that why you dated one that was younger than your daughter? Oh my god. This is so good. This is really good. When I see these like almost chicken wings, I wonder what happened to the rest of the chicken. You know? I'm not really concerned about what happened to the rest of the chicken. I'm concerned about what happened to your neck. Why does he look like he just stubbed his toe when he chomps down on something? The most exotic food I've ever had was probably... Um, well, I grew up in, in the Midwest, the Ozarks. I would have um, escargot and, and mountain oysters, which are bulls balls. Bulls balls? He eats his own kind. Oh, those are good. In Tokyo, where they would seat about like four to five people. Also, who hangs up a fucking mirror on their fence? Why? And then they had these little vegetables. They look like celery and onion. I forgot what they're called, but they're so good. 
This is really good. Mm-hmm. Really good. Yeah. Yeah, we know. I wonder if I'm getting any. What are you doing? He's a kitty. He's a little kitty. Mm. They're just, they're my favorite. Mm. Mm -hmm. You're ugly. You are disgusting. I'm going to kill you. Give me $200. I love Korean women. I love Asian women. Yeah, Ed, just keep telling me more about your Asian fetish. Uh, I want to hear about it. I love all women. <sighs> You know what? Can I tell you guys a secret? Yes, Ed. Give us the tea. I'm starting to date again when I ask a girl to go out. I hopefully don't do shit like this. When we go to a restaurant, I will, um, I will see how she treats the waiter. And if she's rude to the waiter, she's out. That means she's mean. What a visionary. But if she's nice to the waiter, that means she's probably a nice person. Which means she'll... She'll probably, she'll probably, not probably, but probably, P-R-O-L-Y, she'll probably be nice to me. He just wanted to be famous so bad, but he's so unlikable that now he's just riding that wave of all publicity is good publicity. Yeah, so I guess just keep riding that wave. It seems to be working out really well for you. Don't forget your booster seat. This is so good. Oh my God. It's so hot, though. Oh, these are the best noodles I've ever had. Oh, my God. I'm probably getting food everywhere. I love fries. And Asian women? I love this. Oh, my God. I got to hit this one more time. This is so good. Pick a different adjective. There are so many synonyms out there. I love you guys. Remember, love yourself and laugh at yourself. I'll see you later. All right guys, well I hope you didn't have any dinner plans after witnessing this video. But even if you puked in your mouth multiple times, you should still subscribe. I'll catch you next time. Bye. Ah!